today's episode is a guide to owning a puppy and I've just gotten myself a puppy and she's really cute and her name is Pumpkin so but she's at home now and you'll see her later right now I'm at Pet Safari it's like a supermarket for all pet things so I'm going inside there to pick up some things for Pumpkin so right now Pumpkin has a cage and she is kind of like this but smaller and she sleeps in a corner on a little like blanket I feel so sorry for her because it, like, it's like prisoner like treatment so I will get her like a nice bed lah Okay, how about this? Ah! This is pink. Nice, $32, not so bad. Quite nice, right? See, isn't it cute? It's so pumpkinish. I'm still gonna buy it for pumpkin. I also need to get treats for her. I found the treat, I found the treat. It's this one. This one has cheese in it, and this one doesn't have cheese in it. Pumpkin likes this one, but just for variety, I give her this for so long. Every time we eat the same thing, also sian, right? This is so actual, I should have bought this. Look at her, she's a model. Uh, show love. Oh, oh. Like this one. Uh. Oh, nothing to say about snowzers. Okay, lor, don't mind them. I don't think they're particularly very cute. Look like old men. I guess we're done with the puppies. None as cute as mine. Oh, these are like... Oh, those like bull dogs, uh, scary looking dogs. Pumpkin has to stay away from them, otherwise she will get raped. She's so cute, confirm. Oh. This is what happens to your dog if you don't brush their teeth. Good teeth if you brush it. Bad teeth if you don't brush. You can literally smell it, right? Severe tartar accumulation. Severe periodontal disease. Gingivitis. Okay, I'm just reading from here. <laughs> As if I'm very knowledgeable, right? Should I get Pumpkin this toy? Oh dear lord. How much is like your this thing? Uh? $2.50. Okay, I want to get the onion. <laughs> it's stupid looking. If I'm pumpkin, I also want to buy this. Okay, we're done here. So I'm now I'm back home from Pet Safari and it's uh, time to introduce you to pumpkin. When I saw her at the pet store, she was the only one who was very quiet. And when I held her in my hands, right, she like just like stay there like this uh, very quietly and let me do it. But I was cheated because at that point she was sick. So now she's really active and not not what I thought she was. Come here, pumpkin. Pee pee time. Why don't you show everybody how clever you are? Hmm? Oh my gosh, she's gonna do it. She's gonna make me so proud. Good girl. Apparently dogs are really retarded. Like once they pee outside, you cannot wet your dog and tell your dog like shit, you have peed here, you shouldn't have done that. Because the dog has very short term memory, so it doesn't realize that it was the one who like peed there. You it stepped on its own pee, it's so gross. Hum hum. So the way I train her is to literally close the door and sit here and wait for her to pee. When she pees, like give her treats and praise, praise her so she knows that. She has to pee in here. Okay, now it's time for me to get all the stuff that I bought for her and see if she likes it. I'm quite excited. Come here, pumpkin! Come here! So nice. Big tomato for a pumpkin. And your bed. Ta-da! Pumpkin bed. I don't know if she likes it or not, but I like it. Maybe she hates pink. I think dogs are colorblind though. Okay. Nah, aqua. Don't piss there, ah. it will kill you. The thing about treats is that you're only supposed to give it to them when they are like good, being good. Come here, pumpkin. Hey, you don't come here, you don't get it. Come here. Come here. Come here. Don't be a retard. Come here. Okay, you rather go there than you don't get this. I'm gonna eat it all up by myself. That's right. I got cheese snacks. Wow, the goodbye. Come here. Siang Siang Come here Good girl Good girl Why must she always eat so far away from me? I never ever steal her food, I swear So all the puppy training schools will tell you the same thing Like, 
which is to use positive reinforcement. Every time they do something good, you have to give them like treats and praise them extravagantly. And negative reinforcement is not good because dogs are very stupid and they don't know what exactly they did wrongly to deserve that kind of treatment. So they just get them very confused and scared of you. But I, I believe in a little bit of spanking sometimes. When your dog barks too much, hold her like this in the nozzle and don't let her bark. Just stop it. Or either that or you can spray them with water in the face. But they really don't like it. But she likes to nip at people's ankles and it's fucking painful. It's like her teeth are like damn sharp and small. <laughs> on my expense. Ow! You fucker! Since you're on the topic of pets, I may as well show you what made me bought pumpkin in the first place. My ham ham, which I love a lot. It's very very tame and very nice. And she's so cute. She loves ham ham seeds. She's so cute when she's eating, she's just like a fat lump. The relationship between Pumpkin and Nano, not very good. I think Pumpkin wants to kill her. Pumpkin! Nano's like super scared of her. She bite Nano before one time, so I never let them get close ever again. Friend! Yeah, I hope some of the tips were helpful to you. I'm not trying to be one of those like disgusting animal lovers that try to teach people what to do, but that's just things that I've realised were useful or like I've read online. I don't even know if they work. So yeah, and wow, so naughty. Yeah, I love Nano more than you. You gotta work harder. Yeah, so that concludes our episode. If you kill Nano, mommy will smack you so hard you fly. To Jurong. <laughs> <laughs>